water and soak your gongra seeds in it overnight. And the next day, get a wet paper towel and place your gongra seeds on it. Make sure you place them far away from each other to maintain distance. And if you didn't notice, there's actually one seed sprouting. Then close the paper with the other end, like this. And then get a container and put the paper towel in it. And then close the lid. These are how they germinated. They actually sprouted a little. So just after one day it sprouted a little like a wet paper towel and then covered the seeds with that and we left them overnight and one day later this is how they look so they germinated so now they're ready to put in the soil let's go here we're gonna plant the seeds with my pencil i'm gonna put some holes i'm gonna put one here here everywhere so and so make sure you add enough holes for all of your seeds. I use my pencil to put the holes. Now it's time to drop the seeds one by one in, in each row. And now I'm gonna put a seed. Ooh. I'm going to put the seed inside. water it. So gently water the seeds completely. I will water them daily and check on them every day. Hello everyone. This is day four. Please just look at them grow. I am so happy to see them growing like this because they are growing very good so far. This is day four progress to them. They grew so nice. Day eight progress. And it seems like they grew a little taller now. And they also grew their third leaf, they also grow their third leaf, see, the third leaf, and on each one, third leaf started growing, so this is the progress of it, day eight, and they grew like this. Hello everyone, this is day ten of these Gongora seedlings, it seems like they grew a little, they now are growing very well. It's day 10 and this is how they look. After one month, they will grow very big. And, and we have another set of big plants and I will show them. Hi, these are my Gongra plants and these are how they look actually after 50 days. And they grow very well. So I'm so in this video I'm going to harvest them. So just do it at this point, just do it at this cut steps. Okay. One of the most famous dishes in India because it's a very popular. Cut the long 
from the leaves and every single time these produce more leaves. These plants are very healthy and I actually really like them. And they're very healthy, see? And new gungaroo leaves will grow and then we'll har and then we'll harvest them again to make some gungara. Thanks for watching. Bye.